What's going on guys? Chris back with you with another unboxing and review video and today it's gonna be for this bad boy right here and forgive my pronunciation I'm probably gonna botch it but it's gonna be for the Anonzu desk lamp LED desk lamp at that and forgive me if I botch the pronunciation like all my products it's always listed in the description box below the video so you can read more about it pick one up yourself I did take a sneak peek at it already and it's dropped it gorgeous so let's get right on into it you open up the box here and reveals this beautiful beautiful piece of artwork right here and you're like is that the lamp no that's not the lamp that is actually the tin that contains the lamp and it's absolutely awesome so here is the empty box now with our little plastic here let's get rid of that and again the tin that is an aluminum tin right there absolutely fantastic i believe this does come in a couple of different colors and it kind of has a you can't really see that in the camera but a carbon fiber type of material looking aluminum case down here with picture of the desk lamp right there let's go ahead and open it on up and get right on into it because it is a very very sexy lamp we have our instruction manual here and it looks like uh, just kind of like a postcard type thing here they always like to put inside there we have chinese on one side and we have directions in English on the other, which is absolutely fantastic. Let me run a couple specs by you guys real quickly. This is, of course, model AS11188. Size is 170 millimeters by 84.5 millimeters by 237 millimeters. It has Bluetooth 4.0. Transmission distance is 10 meters or about 33 feet. Power input is 100 through 240 volt through 50, 60 hertz. Output power is 5 watt times 2. Power consumption is 15 watts. Working temperature is 0 through 45 degrees Celsius. Working humidity is 20 through 80 percent. Inside we get a Bluetooth speaker, AC power cable, 3.5 millimeter audio cable, and product manual. And without further ado, let's go ahead and lift it on out of here and take a look at that. I forgot to mention that earlier in the video, but desk lamp with Bluetooth 4.0 speaker. We'll be putting that to a test in just a second. Let's get this plastic off of the top here and let's go ahead and take it for a run we got the power cable here we have our AUX cable here we already brought out the instruction manual and I don't believe there's anything else underneath but we're always going to check you can always keep that nice tin for storage or whatever you want to do okay so let's grab my iPhone let's plug this guy in and let, I'll meet you guys right over behind me. okay so what we're gonna do here is we're gonna pair it to my iPhone 6 so what we're gonna do here is I'm guessing you have to hold down the power button for a little bit and until it goes into pair mode that probably was the chime for pair mode but I'm gonna go into my Bluetooth settings on my iPhone and see what we can find out yep we got it right there a touch let's go ahead and Okay, we are connected. We did hear a little chime when it did connect, which is awesome. So let's go ahead and play some music first, see how the speaker sounds. Then we'll go ahead and play around with the dimming functions of the lamp, etc. So let's fire up some Pandora music. We can't play too much, obviously, because copyright strike laws and all that fun stuff. But let's go ahead and see what we got. We'll go ahead and play something with a little bit of beat to it. Of course, you can turn it up. Very nice for a little desktop lamp, I'll tell you what. speakers one on each side the back of it here the bottom very cool guys very nice Definitely sounds pretty good, especially for two small speakers in the side. This is actually a really very nice lamp right here. Very cool looking lamp as well. Let's go ahead and try out the sliding feature here. I believe we have to remove these direction symbols here. So I think that's just there for your direction purposes. Let's remove those stickers. There's one on each side. All right, guys, let me show you a couple really cool features of the lamp before we let you go. Of course, we're gonna go ahead and just turn it on right there. Connects via Bluetooth. Remember Remember, you do have your AUX cable if you want to skip Bluetooth, and that flicker is due to the camera lens camera. It's not flickering in real life as I'm looking at it here. So, 
That's the connection symbol. You just heard that little chime right there. That's where you know it is connected to Bluetooth. So let me show you the dimming situation here. So I found out that it's a little tricky with one hand. We can try it here, see if it works. But sometimes you gotta be careful, obviously, not to push the lamp. But let's see if we can do it here. See, there it goes a little bit. There we go. Um, I think it actually dims a little bit more than that. There we go. And then we go ahead and do it again. So I like to go ahead and put my fingers right here. And then you just need to slide at a nice little even pace here and we go all the way up. So your sliding of the dimming is gonna be up here. You probably wouldn't really use that feature to be honest with you too much, so just go ahead and jack it all the way up. Now the left hand side over here, that is for your volume. All right guys, for this portion of the video, I'm gonna be showing you two features of the left slide bar for the volume up and down and then for the pause play, which is gonna be your power button. So you would hold it down and turn the lamp off you would just tap it one time while the music is on to pause, play, etc. Right now it is on pause, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the pause play feature first. So we can't play again too much music because of copyrights. So it will be able to play if it hasn't already played, so you just go ahead and tap that. The music plays, tap it one more time, and it pauses it here, so that's really cool. And then let's go ahead and check out the slide bar on the volume. So I'm gonna go ahead and play it again. We're gonna start up here. Let's just slide your finger down as the volume goes down. Now it's really, really low. Now let's go ahead and slide that back up. Again, slow, nice, constant pressure. There we go, like that, guys. Again, sometimes you do have to use a little bit more pressure, so put your fingers down on this, slide it as you're kind of putting a little bit more pressure on the side rail there. Sometimes it's a little sensitive, sometimes it's not, so you gotta kind of play around with it though. But I have noticed though that you can even go as high as right here, down to right here, et cetera. Let me show you one more time. There we go, down, and then we go back up. There we go, guys. Let's go ahead and pause that there so that we cannot get the copyright, of course, on the video, but overall, a very, very cool, very sleek looking desk lamp. And again, I will link this in the description box below. So thank you guys so much for watching the video and stay tuned because I have more reviews in the books. And again, very sweet lamp. Check it out below. My name is Chris. I'll see you guys on the next review. Bye-bye.